You're watching CTV News, Calgary. March 20th is celebrated as the International Day of Happiness. It's a UN designated day dedicated to the importance of happiness in people's life. According to this year's World Happiness Report, Canada ranks 15th. Well, one thing that might help in your journey toward happiness is this book, Too Fat, Too Loud, Too Ambitious, a spiritual self-help workbook by Davina Kaur. It's for anyone who's tired of hating and hiding their unique authentic self and joining us now is Davina Kaur. Thanks very much for speaking with us this afternoon. Hi Ian and thank you for having me. So how would you define happiness? So Ian just before I came on today's show I asked everybody around me, I, uh, people I met while dog walking, um, people I met in elevators like what is your definition of happiness and interestingly enough everybody's definition of happiness is different and happiness isn't about the the absence of problems or the stress that we all are going through right now or the you know mental health issues are at their highest happiness is how we define it and what it means to you as an individual mm -hmm. i wonder is there anything that happened in your life that made you start thinking in a different way that you you realize there is a different approach to happiness well, you know, I myself have actually overcome self-harm thoughts and suicidal thoughts. And one day I was sitting by the river and I was like, I'm just going to jump in and end my life because I was so um, unhappy with everything that was going on. I was going through a divorce. I was very uh, stressed at work. Um, but then there was this little voice in me that said, you know what? Wait, before you end up killing yourself, which was the easier solution. I was like, why don't you go within and see what it is that your purpose is? And that's how my shift happened, the constant questioning, the decision to not end my life. And yes, like this right now with COVID, we're all struggling in different ways. Mm -hmm. Well, we're glad you made the right decision. Absolutely. Uh, <laughs> there's no doubt. Uh, there are skeptics right now. It has been a tough year. A lot of people have yes. lost jobs. A lot of people dealing with social isolation. What would you say directly to those people who are dealing with the, the real impact of COVID-19? Yeah, so, you know, like, like happiness and the, the pain, the suffering, the struggle that we're all going through, it's not about denying our, our darkness. It's not about denying our emotions. Our emotions are sacred. We have to pay attention to them. And the more we listen to our emotions, the more we're going to realize that they're always talking to us. And, you know, the like, I'll give you an example. The car battery runs on the, the negative and the positive, and it takes both of that to make a car run. So similarly, our emotions are, you know, the, the reason to, to live, to find joy in spite of not having work, in spite of struggling with so much. And we all know somebody or the other who's struggling with mental health, job loss. So we just have to say, you know what? Yes, this is what's going on. But this moment of, for example, me being happily on camera right now, it's to find those little joys in everything that we do. And that's the key. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I checked out your YouTube page and you have some video on there of you volunteering. That's part of your equation, isn't it, to happiness? Yes, so um, I find the more gratitude I give, the more I give back, whether it's time, energy, emotions. Um, you know, I love to volunteer. It's part of my culture. I'm, I'm born and raised in India. And um, also, you know, I, I, we run a nonprofit foundation. Sexy Brilliant is 100% registered nonprofit foundation. And our mission is to remove toxic shame and raise human consciousness. So that's what I live. I live and do it every day. And the more I do it, the more I find the joy and abundance I can share with the world. And that's a choice that we all have to make to give thanks to what we have. All right. Well, thanks very much for sharing your story with us and uh, have a great afternoon. Have a great weekend, too. Thank you and, and happy Happiness Day to everybody. All right. Thanks very much. And for more information to connect with Davina, go to her website, sexybrilliant.org. You can find her on various social media platforms, including YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.